We're at the midway I now. I don't have much time, Vince. You are very close to Cosmo's center of power. He has me captive somewhere nearby. Just get through the midway. A great weight and a great noise are required here. Well, the carnival actually, as Vince has made it there. Hurry, you idiots! He's almost here! Well, I don't know, boss. He's real tiny. Can't we just kick him or something? He's small, yes, but he has uncanny powers. I can't believe he beat that hurricane! Ah, ah. <laughs> Get it out! Hey, boss, ain't you, you know, disembodied? Oh, yeah! Get this thing to the big top! Everything must be ready when Madame Charmaine's little friend arrives! So yet yeah, Cosmo had something in his eyes. He disappears and then... One of his minions... Got hurt by it. But anyway, we're at the final area of the game, which is a carnival to pray. Starting off with the midway. Glad in fall. So today is Christmas Eve, and I'm gonna try to do the last five parts probably sooner. Since I want to get Crash 2 and Spongebob Battle for Bikini Bottom started ASAP And the exploding armadillos are back I haven't seen them in a while While we try to get away from them that is Where does it all go? Oh, you know where it goes. You keep it. There's our 25 zombie dust and one voodoo icon here. And we also have one more level where we need to collect the skull pages. There's another zombie that's here. I'll collect it later. Since I don't want to risk falling. Because I will be needing my voodoo powers. The world's strongest kitten. I don't think it's strong anymore since it's been abused by this 50 pound weight. We don't need to use it right now. We'll use it later. Alright, so there are five coins here. There are five coins where we need to collect. And let me show you where you get those five coins. Like, use your boot powers on the Spubble Gator. Just Swamp Pepper. And there's a coin that appears on a chair right here. Let me show you where to deposit them. How am I gonna go through here? Well, I need to go anywhere if they want to go 100%. Deposit the coins. Right here. As a 
powers of the fortune teller tells you what to do. A single coin you found is true, but four more coins I asked of you. Is this Lady Curia? Yeah, it looks like it. And she says, I hold your future. Wish I had a fortune teller to tell me about my future. Just checking how many zombies we collected. So nine. And then you can get a coin from here. Just hopefully that a frog didn't show up. Plus if you do need Buddha powers, that is. Oh maybe. Well storage for Buddha powers. Where you collect the beads. Now you do this again until you reach the coin. And there's a coin. And then you can do this again for all an extra life. So we deposit another coin. What does Lady Curia have for us? A count of two coins is your score. Step lively now and find three more. Why don't we go somewhere which requires voodoo powers? Well, actually, I spy a voodoo icon over there. Just meet the cleaver. So anyway, we'll be going somewhere which requires blue powers, which involves bubble gators. No, I just realized maybe I should have gotten that blue icon. Maybe later on, just in case if I fell down or got myself injured. By injured, meaning dead while getting hurt by some enemies. Alright. This is where we go next. The doors close on us. So all you do is use your voodoo powers over here. You can see the insides of Vince. The insides of the bubble gators. Sure to write. And here's another coin. Alright, let's go and deposit this coin. It would be cool if a carnival came to my town. It used to when I was a kid, right near my high school, but not anymore. But there are more carnivals nearby. So now she tells her fortune. My fortune grows, I now have three. Just find two more coins for me.
And I also need to go back to the Zalva because... Well, the one that I just intentionally missed from the beginning. As now I have 10. So 15 more to go. As I don't see any more. Got three more right here. We just press the switch and out comes all the frogs. She can easily use her blue powers on them. We could have been friends. All shaped like jackhammers. It's a lot of bees that we got. At least I got all my voodoo powers back. All nine of them. I don't think we'll be needing to use any more voodoo powers from now on. Until we get to the next level that is. Alright, so on we go. That's a far away walk. Now you we deposit the fourth coin. Four pretty coins, you're almost done. Now go and find the final one. Should I? I'm just paying for an extra life. Oh, on my first try. As I have 40 lives. How lucky of me. Alright, why don't I go back for the zombie dust? I missed two more over here. There's another one all the way there. Just gotta get past this exploding armadillo. So that's 17. Make that 8 more to go. Because I do know where the other zombies are. For this one, you have to time it right. It doesn't really matter where I land off because. One of these have the coin, and one of these has the zombie. No, wait, not. Yeah, the zombie dust. Alright, so let me just time this right. Oh no. Darn. Still ugly. Oh no, need to worry. I don't really need my voodoo powers for now. Alright, so zombie dust are right here. Oh 
I don't really need to step on those ducks. I can just go here. How do I time this right? There's a coin. Ready to be picked up. Yeah, I do regret getting that Meet the Cleaver Google icon. Should've gotten right now. Now that I have no powers left. Considering that I fell down and not timed it right. Now here's the last coin to deposit. I have all five, I'll let you through, but Cosmo is expecting you. Just to make sure, we need to collect four more zombies. And over here, I think I know it's here. An extra life, back to 40. So tomorrow will be Christmas. As I do have plans over Christmas Day. Which does include reporting the next part of Voodoo Vince. So after this it'll be I think let's see Yeah four more parts And then I'm all done with Rudovin's rewalker It's one of those bell ringy thingies Too bad it's missing some pieces or I could show off my awesome physique Okay, so now we have all 25 zombie dust and one voodoo icon. And no, you do not use vents. This is where we go next. So what you do is pick up this bowling ball. And place it on this bucket which goes down the well. Watch it look to Nanbill. Oh, so that's what it's called, Nanbill. Keep forgetting what things are called. So you have this 50 pound anvil. And then what you do is wait for it. Place it right here so Vince can ring the bell. Breaks the glass. So yeah, that's everything that we got. So next stop is all the regular attractions, which I'll do for the next part. See you guys later. Merry Christmas to all and to all a good night.